Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. Now, as you can see here, we're in Cerulean City, and today we will be heading over here down to a place where we haven't been before. Uh, you're gonna need Surf. I'm not sure if you need Strength or Rock Smash. I believe you need Rock Smash. But we're gonna sail over here, and previously before there was a guy there, but there isn't anymore. Uh, oh, we have a trainer here. So let's proceed and battle her. And um, if, you know, if the music sounds kind of funny, it's because like I sped it up just slightly, just to make the video a little bit shorter. You know, just because um, this girl's Pokemon are low level because you can battle her as soon as you get Surf. So yeah, that's why your Pokemon are in the 30s. Now, um, if you would have came here before beating the Elite Four for the first time. There would have been a guy standing in front of that little cave. But since we beat the Elite Four, that guy is gone. Because apparently, the Pokemon in that cave are pretty dang strong. Alright, so we beat her. And let's continue. Let me just check it. Nope, there's nothing over there. And let's go inside. We are in Cerulean Cave. <laughs> Looks so weird. Alright, so let's use Surf. As you can see, there's some ladders around here. And yeah, so let's go up this ladder first. And let's see what's over here. Rock Smash, yes. So we need Rock Smash for this place. I don't think we need Strength. I think it's just Rock Smash and Surf. Alright, so we have, we have a full restore here. Awesome. So now let's go back down down there yes okay and let's continue on through the water Whoop. and now uh, let me pick this up real quick and damn it stupid pokemon oh, that's a go bet and i have a crow bet cool uh, yeah let's just run Gonna use another super max repel, my bad. And no, not go up that one. Pick this up, it's a nugget, awesome. And go up here. You can see nothing there, no secret items. Okay. Let's use Rock Smash. And nothing there, okay. So let's just continue on. Nothing here, that's cool. Yeah, I don't know where any of the hidden items are, so, yeah. Um, uh, use Rock Smash here. And, yeah, that's pretty much the maze. What do we have here? We have a PP up. That's pretty much what we're going to be doing. Just going up ladders, going into this maze, just to get to the end. Um, go down and through there. Looks like there would be an item right here. I'm not sure if there is or not. No, no, okay. Probably on the right there. I didn't check that. Um, go up here. No, okay. I'm just breaking these rocks. Um, so I don't know if you guys played this. And there we have an Ultra Ball. But um, there's this game that like I've seen like everyone playing. It's called 2048. And there's a Max Elixir there. Now, um, 2048 is like so addicting. It's a tile game, and there's 16 tiles, and you know. You control it with the directional pad, and you, there's numbers like the game gives you twos and fours, mostly twos. And when basically, the how to play the game, you can just combine tiles of the same number, and you know they add up. So let's say you have a two and two, combine them to get a four, and in order to combine them, you know you have to like make them um, crash into each other. So yeah, then um. The objective of the game is to get 2048 because it will be 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128, 256, 512, 10, 24, and then 2048. So yeah, that is the objective of the game. And um, yeah, I've beaten it about like 5, 6 times. But it's not for the 2048 that I'm doing it. I'm doing it for the 4096, which is like really hard. Oh my god, really? A step after the 
the max power wears off, we run into this guy. Goodbye. So yeah, that, oh my god, 2040, getting a 4096 is like, impossible. Um, I know this is the right way to go, but of course I'm dumb enough, and I just go around checking like, um, uh, I feel like I missed something. But nope, I didn't. And apparently I forgot to use Max Repel. So let's just run, and continue going. Um, use the Max Repel first, of course. And we've been through all of that. And yep, now let's make our way back because we actually did everything. Probably should have cut that out. Ah, so stupid. Anyways, make our way back over here. Go down the ladder. And nothing here. Why do I run? Don't I have a max repel out? 67, holy crap. That's pretty, pretty high level. For a ditto, too. Alright, so let's continue. Uh, nothing there. Go around here. And there's an item there. Don't need to break any of those rocks. We have a max revive. Cool. Break this rock because I feel like there's an item there. I'm not sure if there is. Nope. Probably on the right. Uh, Repels effect war off. Let's use another one so we don't run into more Pokemon. Uh, go up. There's an item right here. We have a Ultra Ball. Awesome. I don't have too many for this upcoming battle, which we are actually almost up to. Our Okay, I'm making sure. Alright, so let me save real quick. And let's battle Mew 2. <laughs> Mew. Even though it's a Mew 2. Now, Mew 2 is one of like the hardest Pokemon to catch in this game. And of course. Yeah, very hard. So, you know, let me just bring its health down and stuff. Then my plan is to paralyze it with um, Thunder. Of course, there goes Ali. So yeah, let's switch out the thunder, uh, paralyze it, and then bring itself down. Thunder wave, and then let's use bite. No, yep, bite. And then another bite should do it, as long as we don't die. Yes. Okay, we're good. Flinch. No, come on. Yep, another bite. Good job. Oof. And now I'll start using the Ultra Balls and stuff. And of course Mewtwo being very hard to catch. I believe it has like a 1% catch rate. This is not going to go in. So I'll see you guys when I do catch the Pokemon. Uh, later on. Alright so I caught Mewtwo. As you can see full health paralyzed. And guess what? I caught it in a Pokeball. Mm -hmm. With two Pokeballs left, I caught Mewtwo, which is pretty awesome, because I was falling asleep while doing this, because it took so long, like three days of not being able to catch it, so um, I'm using Escape Rope right here, look I just saw that, I have two Pokeballs left, I had a couple Ultra Balls, Great Balls, and a bunch of Pokeballs, alright so we're out of Cerulean Cave, let's just, yeah, everyone died in that battle. A uh, flatter cerulean, so I can show you guys the PC box for once. Now, I remember last episode I told you guys that I would um, do um, an evolutions episode, but like that was too boring, so I just went ahead and did all that evolving by myself. So there we go, put you two there, and show off in the beginning. Now every everyone's dead, so I'll put Charizard in. Let me just take this, oops, take this uh, unknown C, put it there. Alright, now in here goes Ali, right down there. Um, over here goes um, Eggie. Here goes 
Thunder and Shelly. And pretty much it's everyone. Alright. Uh, I could have just kept Crobat there. Oh, that's my last Pokemon. Because apparently Crobat is dead. So I just switch him in. And put it look, put it back. Wait, no, nope, it goes there. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure that's where it goes. And yes it does. So we have that box full, that box full. Um, so that's 1 to 60, 1 to 90, 1 to 120, 1 to 150. So we technically completed that. And next episodes, I'll probably be catching all of those Pokemon. Um, Johto and Hoenn Pokemon. You know, I'll show you off this. Uh, I'll show you guys the cheats for that. Because, you know, I want to catch all of them. Now, I'm going to meet you guys in Solid Ground City. Now, here at the Game Freak Development Room and um, the Solid Ground Condominiums, um, talk to these guys here. The graphic artist, he drew you. That's actually pretty cool. There's this guy, the programmer. It's kind of what I, what I want to be. And you're going to want to talk to this guy. Wow, excellent. You completed your Pokedex. Congratulations. This document is issued in recognition of magnificent, magnificent achievement. The completion of the Kanto Pokedex. Game Freak. Awesome. Um, let me see if he says anything different. And of course he does not. Alright guys, so... I'll see you guys on the next episode where we will be doing the Elite Four Round 2. Alright. Goodbye guys.